Hey guys, in this video, I'll show you how you can fix multiplayer connection issues on Xbox Series X. Alright, so let's begin with the video. First, check your internet connection. Ensure your internet connection is stable and fast enough for online gaming. Then, use a wired connection instead of Wi-Fi to minimize latency. After that, run a speed test to confirm your download and upload speeds are sufficient. Then, restart your modem and router to refresh the connection. You can also check for any bandwidth-heavy applications running on your network that could affect gaming. Next, update your game. Go to the Xbox dashboard and select My Games and Apps. Find Dragon Ball Sparking Zero in your library. Highlight the game and press the menu button, then select Manage Game. Also, check for any available updates and install them. Then, restart the game after updating to ensure all changes take effect. Next, configure NAT settings. Open your Xbox settings and navigate to Network Settings. Check your NAT type. It should ideally be open. If it's strict or moderate, consider enabling UPnP Universal Plug and Play on your router. Alternatively, set up port forwarding for the game using the following ports, TCP 80, 443, 3074. UDP 88, 500, 3074, 3544, 4500. Then, save the changes and restart your Xbox for the new settings to take effect. After that, reboot your console. Power down your Xbox Series X completely by holding the power button for 10 seconds. Unplug the console from the power outlet for about a minute. Plug it back in and power it on again. This can help clear temporary glitches affecting the connection. After rebooting, launch Dragon Ball Sparking Zero to see if the issue persists. Then, clear cache. Turn off your Xbox and unplug it from the power source. Press and hold the power button for 10 seconds to clear the cache. Then, wait for a minute before plugging it back in. Restart your console and try launching the game again. This can help resolve any cached data issues causing connectivity problems. Lastly, check Xbox Live status. Visit the official Xbox Live status page to see if there are any ongoing server issues. If the servers are down, you may need to wait until they are back online. So that's basically how you can fix multiplayer connection issues on Xbox Series X. So that's all for this video. Consider subscribing if you find it helpful. And I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks.